So you've seen the title, so you know exactly what's happening, but yes, I am going to be doing an overnight in my room, but it's going to be in a reading fort. I watch an unhealthy amount of overnight videos, especially from Keen and JC and from TFIL, which is Elton Coste, his uh, channel, and then Sam and Colby, Jake Weber, like the whole group, they do a lot of that. And I thought that I would do an overnight video. Like I've been wanting to do one, but I don't want to go to jail. Um, <laughs> like I've low key been wanting to do a video where I just do an overnight in a library, but I don't know any libraries that are 24 hours. So I don't want to get kicked out of a library unless I try and do one at school. I don't know, like my school library I think is open till like 2 a.m. So maybe I could do that, but honestly, I'm also like not trying to do that. We'll see. I don't know, maybe if we get this video to like an X amount of likes, I'll do that. But in the meantime, here is this video. This was also inspired by Jesse the Reader's video. He did a video where he only read under the covers for a week and I was like, whoa, I love that. Um, so here we are. And I have not created the reading for it yet. I have been drinking, <laughs> so I'm going to drink and I am going to create my reading for it. And then I think maybe at like 10 p.m. I will start my adventure <laughs> um, because hockey is on right now and it's intermission. And I was like, I need to do this quick. So here we are. Uh, yeah, so here's a montage of me making the reading for it. I hope it works because honestly, I don't even know if it's going to work, but give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it and let's get started. <laughs> Okay, so we've got the fort behind me, the reading fort kind of thing. I'm actually gonna sleep here because this is an overnight. So this is basically like an overnight of me sleeping on my floor. Um, but I made some cookies. I made pumpkin chocolate chip cookies. Never, I've used the recipe before, but I don't know if they actually worked out. So <laughs> taste test. I also have two books that I'm reading, so this is also like a reading vlog because like I still need to incorporate reading into this, but you're probably curious to know what the inside looks like because my camera cut off as I was doing a montage. It's fine. Great time, great night. It's fine. Um, it's currently like 10.30 p.m. I'm pretty sure, and now I'm gonna bring you under here. Uh, this is probably like the most casual video I've ever done. I'm also going to start looking for Alaska on Hulu. And honestly, I haven't watched it yet because I wanted to watch it in this video in my reading nook fort thing. I know I'm going to keep saying nook, but it's a reading fort. And it's also held up by tripods and I'm really terrified that they're going to fall down and I'm going to die in my sleep. So pray for me, hopefully that doesn't happen. And here is the grand reveal. I also am using my tripod. So we're doing vlog style. Welcome to the channel <laughs> and welcome to my reading for Ha ha ha. I should have got a tent. Honestly, want to get a tent 
and try this out again, but we'll see. It's, it's, I haven't even slept here yet, so who knows. But I would like to get a tent at some point. That would be fun. Um, but here we are. Uh, we've got my reading pillow behind me. We've got me, we've got a chair. Um, we've got my books. Here's like where I'm going to sleep. Um, <laughs> we've got my blankets, we've got my cookies and almond milk. Got my computer, got some other blankets, and a tripod, and now my camera is dying great. Um, so, let me show you what I'm reading. It is currently Spookathon. It's October 19th, um, because my best friend just got married yesterday. Um, but I am reading Snapdragon for my graphic novel. That's what I'm gonna start. And I just talked about that in my book haul, so you can see that in the cards and down below. I got a bunch of 2020 releases. This doesn't come out till February, but I really wanted to read a graphic novel. And here comes Luna, who has been following me around all day because she just wants to cuddle. And honestly, I'm not mad about it. You like it? Say hi. <laughs> so you will have seen in my book haul that I hauled a bunch of 2020 releases. And if you haven't, go and watch it after this video. Um, and for Spookathon, I am reading No Exit by Taylor Adams, but I have it on hold for my library. And they put this pink slip on it and I can't take it off. And it's really annoying me. Um, but I just started it today or maybe I started it yesterday. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I've been reading more of it today, but I'm enjoying it, but I also spoiled myself by trying to figure out what it was about, and then I got spoiled, but that's my own fault. But I'm enjoying it. It's cool. I just started it, so I don't really have many thoughts, and that is just what's happening. I guess I'll update you, like, more so throughout the night, but I'm gonna try a cookie right now because, I don't know, I don't, like, have anything for this vlog. Also, here's Luna. So as I said that this is just like a vlog, I don't even know what I'm gonna be doing. I'm probably just gonna be vlogging myself. So now that I've showed you all the books I'm going to read, I'm probably just gonna read, watch Hulu, and then update you before I go to bed. I don't know, like, I don't want to be up too late, but I also, like, want to have content for this and not just have it be, like, shit. Um, but I also kind of want to be up tomorrow at a decent time because we- But for now, I'm going to try one of my cookies. Um, here we go. Here. Let's try this one. <laughs> um, this is hard because I have to, like, hold my camera, but- here is my cup of milk, almond milk. And let's just do it. Oh my god. Oh, that is not cooked all the way. Oh my god. I don't think it's cooked all the way. I kind of figured it wasn't, but maybe it is. I don't know. Am I gonna die? Probably. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. It's fine. I kind of figure that because they kind of looked like they weren't done, but I couldn't tell, so it was a fail. It's fine. I'm gonna read, drink the rest of my milk, and I will update you guys later. Bye. From me and Luna. Say bye. Support me on Patreon so I can buy a tent. <laughs> oh, you got a live bear trying to get in our tent. <laughs> Go away, bear. We don't got any food while he's putting his paw on the tent. <laughs> um, this is really uncomfortable, but I'm going to start Snapdragon and I will let you guys know what I think of it. I don't know too much about it, but I know it's like witchy or something like that and Honestly, I am all about that, so let's read. <laughs>
I don't even know what I am like today. I don't even know. I, it's just like I haven't like planned out this video, so it's just gonna be very crazy, and I hope you enjoy that. <laughs> It's 10.30 in the morning on the next day and I'm gonna play some clown music because I failed this challenge. At like midnight, I went to sleep on the floor and it was just cold and I just kind of wanted to sleep in my bed and then I went and slept in my bed. <laughs> so, sorry. <laughs> but before I end this video, I do want to talk about Snapdragon. It was so good. I really enjoyed it. I think I'm gonna give it a five star. Um, it is a middle grade about a uh, this is a middle grade about a girl named Snapdragon and she's like a tomboy um, and it's just Oh my gosh, it was so good. I really liked this because it had like LGBT themes and I didn't think that that was even going to play a role. Um, but there is a character who is a trans girl and they like transition and come out basically. And it was so cute and amazing. And the main character, Snapdragon, she is kind of a tomboy. Um, she's probably a lesbian, honestly. Um, but she does just say how, like, she doesn't feel like, at least she feels like a girl, but she doesn't feel like a normal girl. Um, and I really enjoyed that. That was such a powerful scene, um, because her mom, like, asks her if she feels like the, um, trans character. And she says no, and it's awesome. Oh my gosh, this was just very accepting and, like, nice. And it had, like, a witch and... Oh my gosh, it was just great. I'm trying not to spoil it, but definitely pick it up when it comes out. Add it to your TBR. I really enjoyed it. And so I'm going to end this video here. Sorry it was like kind of a flop, but at least you guys got a little review kind of thing from me. At least you got like a book recommendation. So thank you all for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and hit subscribe if you haven't. And I will see you all next time. I hope you're having a great day.